KPM. Look at the beauty of this view. It's worth hiking this hill for two hours. John, what was that? That sound was loud. It seems like there's some humans that are cutting down trees illegally. There's a forest area that is on fire. And it looks like those animals are trying to save themselves. The river is so dirty, the factory waste and garbage are released into the river uncontrollably. What effect will it have if this activity is not controlled and stopped? Hi everybody, welcome to Tahap 2 here at Didate TV KPM. My name is Chris MJ and today we will be learning Science DLP for Year 6 together with Teacher Devi. Hi Teacher, how are you Teacher? Hi Chris, I'm oh, good. You are Thank good. you. How I'm, about you? I'm very good as well. I'm very excited for today's lesson. But first, I would also like to welcome Teacher Azliana as our sign language interpreter for today's episode. Thank you very much, teacher. All right. Now, a classroom would not be complete without classmates. So, teacher Devi, yes. who are our pupils for today? Yeah, let me introduce our pupils here. Okay. Okay, we have here uh, Arisha. Hi, Arisha. Hi, Arisha. Okay, and we have uh, Vimal. Hi, Vimal. Hi Vimal. And uh, we have uh, uh, Tamilendi. Okay, Tamilendi. Hi Tamilendi. Hi Tamilendi. And uh, we have uh, Falisha Amani. Hi Tam Falisha. Hi Falisha. Wow, okay. So these are our pupils for today's lesson. But before we proceed with our science DLP year 6, yes. I would like to ask my friends on Google Meets as well as those watching at home, are you ready? If you're ready, give me a thumbs up. Okay, very, very good. Uh, well, yeah, teacher, we what are we going to learn today? Yes, uh, if you saw the video just now. Oh, yes, what did the video have to do with today's lesson? Yes, today we are going to learn about threat of extinction. Ooh, wow. Threat That's of a, extinction. Yeah, it's about plants and animals that are facing the threat of extinction. Uh, if never control, uh, we can uh, the animals and plants will face extinction straight away. We won't find them after that. Oh. So we have to control how to control the animals and plants from extinct. This is All what right. we are going to learn today. Okay. So yep. shall we begin today's lesson? Yep. Yes. Today. So the our topic today is threat of extinction. Okay, if you look at this, uh, today the people is going to learn uh, how to explain the true example, the animals and plants that are facing the threat of extinction. And they are able to describe the factors that cause the threat of extinction to animals and plants. And uh, people so can generate ideas on the effects of preservation and conservation of animals and plants that are facing the threat of extinction. Okay. okay. So, now we go to the very uh, important topic today. We are going to see animals and plants that are facing the threat of extinction. Okay, let us go through the animals here. Okay, here we have Malayan tiger. Even you can see Malayan tiger there, right? Yes. Okay, and uh, we have elephant. Uh, have you seen elephant, right? Yeah. Usually we can see elephant here. here. Yes, yes, <laughs> this one here. Okay, okay. and hornbills. Okay, hornbills. Oh. These are the example of animals that facing. Uh, we can tell them, tell that yeah, they are endangered species. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, and next we have panda, and we have orangutan. That we have already proceed orangutan in front here, and Malayan tapir. We have rhinoceros, and we go to the plants now. We have Rafflesia. We have tonka ali plant, we have pitcher plant, and we have sleeper orchid. Okay, mm. Chris, yeah. I want to show you. There's a pitcher plant that oh. we have pitcher plant that facing the threat of extinction. Oh, this one, did you? Yes. Wow. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 
this is the example mm -hmm. of pitcher plant. If you see, we, uh, if we never control, one day we can't find them oh, anymore. Oh wow, that's oh, yeah. sad. So okay. it's going to extinct. So right. these are the pitcher plant. Okay, now we go to the uh, some examples here. Meranti tree, Chengal tree, Kerwing tree. And uh, we are going to ask our students right now. Mm, okay. So we have a quiz for them. Okay, let us ask our pupils out there. Okay, Chris? Yep. Okay. Give the example of animals that are facing the threat of extinction. Who wanted to try? You can raise okay, your hand. Okay, raise your hand. They raise ready. Who you want? Okay, to? maybe we can go with uh, Vimal. Vimal. Okay, Vimal. Yes, teacher, the example of uh, animals that are facing the threat of extinction is panda. Panda. That's panda. good. Okay. Yes, correct answer. Well done. Okay, who any, anyone else want to try? Yes, we are uh, Tamilendi. Yes, teacher Devi. The yep. animals that are facing the threat of extinction is uh, elephants. Elephant. Okay. How about uh, Arisha? Yes, Arisha. You want to try? Yes, teacher. Yeah. The animal that are facing the threat of extinction is um, dugong. Dugong. And what about plants, teacher? Yeah, plant. I'm going to ask plant after this. Okay, very good, Arisha. Dugong is one of the okay. uh, animals that. Okay, now we ask for the example of plant that are facing the threat of extinction. Okay, who wanna try? Raise your hand. Yes, uh, Farisha Hamani. Yes, well, give me one example. Um, animals, uh, plant that are facing ex extinction is Tonka Ali. Tonka Ali, well done, Farisha. So we go with one more. Okay, who wanna tell? Yes, Tamilendi. Yes, teacher Devi. Pla plants that facing the threat of extinction is picture of it. Come on, get picture. Is it picture plant. Picture plant. Picture plant. Okay, plan. okay good. good job, everybody. Good job. Okay. Teacher, can I ask you how did our pupils or how many marks would you give our okay, pupils today? Okay, uh, each of them and their answer, we give them reward. Yep. So, uh, so far, I've seen. Uh, um, uh, Tamil and this uh, twice he answered, so you will get two stars. And Farisha Amani got one star, Vimal one star, Arisha one star. Okay, so, yeah. so congratulations everybody for getting your stars. But first, we will take a short break. Is that alright, teacher? Yes, sure. Okay, for our friends watching at home, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with Teacher Devi for Science DLP Tahun Enam. KPM. Hello everybody, welcome to Tahab Dua here on Didate TV KPM. My name is Chris MJ and today we will be learning science DLP for year 6 on the topic of threat of extinction. Ha, that's why we have all the animals here, right teacher? Exactly, that's okay. why we have not only animals, oh, we have yeah. plants and too. Plants yeah. as well. All right. plant there. So teacher okay. Devi, for this next segment, what will we be learning? Okay, just now we saw example of animals and plants that are facing the threat of extinction, right? Yeah. So we are going to learn how, what are the factors that affect the threat of extinction? Mm, okay, okay. Okay, let us go through the slide here. Okay, the factors that cause the threat of extinction to animals and plants. Okay, we have both here. So, both we can go to the first factor. Okay, mm -hmm. habitat destruction. For the habitat destruction, human builds roads and uh, develop new towns. If you see, there are so many towns, right? Yeah. Developed, okay. And these activities destroy the natural habitat of animals and plants. Oh, okay. okay. And the uh, forests are also burned to make way for planting new crops. Okay, this one, we can say forests not only really burn for that, we also can say related to the development as well. So mm. we want to build new houses, new housing area, new buildings, all that. So we need to uh, sometimes we have to do this habitat destruction and the next point is illegal hunting okay illegal hunting here humans excessively hunt and harvest different types of animals and plants to make medicine 
food ornaments and clothes okay if let have a look here clothes okay we have an example here jacket oh this jacket yes this okay. is a, made of uh, leather okay the skin of the animals but if can we try to avoid to make the clothes uh, from the endangered species yes yeah okay Thank next you. we can have a look some handbags here and the uh, boots all made of animal skin that's uh, clothes we have here and then next is pollution it's a uh, one of the factor uh, that uh, face uh, cause the uh, threat of extinction so disposing of trash such as plastic waste can trap animals okay this can also cause flash floods okay oh, no. all, yeah and if you say oil spill okay oil spill and toxic waste can kill aquatic animals and plants in the sea and, and coastal areas okay this is the main thing we uh, we will discuss this later okay. okay and we go to next is natural disasters okay in this natural disasters such as tornadoes uh, landslides floods and hot uh, i mean uh, earthquakes also destroy uh, the habitat of animals and plants okay natural disaster that are example here i've shown here there's a food flood tornado earthquake and landslide okay mm, and okay. next we go to global warming okay global warming global warming is a uh, very uh, we can say is uh, we can say lately we can see what's the global warming we are having now we are facing that now where uh, where we can see the less heat is released back into the space uh, which cause earth to become warmer so this is released from the factories from the vehicles okay oh, ah okay. it will cause for the global no warming. wonder it's so hot today and nowadays the weather is so terrible because the global warming is exactly I so see. very high the, the temperature is increasing because it, the gases that we release it trapped in our atmosphere right okay. that's why the global warming happens Understood. okay now we have done the five factors here now we go to the quiz time Okay. Oh, okay. Now, we are going to ask our pupils down up there. Uh, do you have your bubble map with you? Can you show your bubble map? Okay, where is your bubble map? Please, show your bubble map. Wow, yeah, okay. okay, there are bubble map. Okay, now we go to the bubble map now. Okay, put down your bubble map. Now, I want you to fill up the bubble map with the factors that affect the threat of extinction. Okay, I give you um, in... Uh, Two minutes. Come on. Two minutes. Yeah. Okay. So factors that affect the threat of extinction. extinction yep. So that should be in the middle. Is that correct? Yeah. Yeah. The middle one. They should write the threat uh, factors. All right. So and the, the five points should be yeah. outside there. Okay. The bubbles. So everyone watching at home, you can try this exercise as well. Yes. Uh, create your own bubble map. And we can start labeling and let's check it together later. But teacher, I have a question regarding to your pollution slide. Yes. Um, why? I, I'm curious to know why? Why would that affect uh, aquatic ex animals or aquatic extinction? Why yeah. would turtles eat plastic bags? Okay, good question, uh, Chris. Actually, when you look at the uh, animals, aquatic animals, even they can uh, differentiate. You know, it looks yeah. similar for them. Okay. With the prey and the plastic bag, they feel is is their prey. I okay. See. Once they look at that, uh, they were attracted with the smell. You know. Uh, this mm. one you should know. Okay, how we can see the smell? We we are not talking about the plastic smell. Oh, not the plastic. Not smell. the plastic smell. Okay. Whenever the plastic inside the, I mean, in the ocean, in the, the ocean, in the ocean. So the algae, you know, algae. Usually, yes, aquatic yes. animals like to eat the algae. Correct. So the algae will grow on the plastic bags. Oh. So when they grow on the plastic bag, the aquatic animals they feel like oh, it's attracted to the smell for the algae. Then they will just. So they Take think in. that plastic is actually algae, uh, okay. but then yeah. when they eat, then the t that's how they get yes. choked then, uh, and then injured. it's poisons for them ah, as well. Okay, so remember, don't throw rubbish everywhere. Throw it in the rubbish bin. If can, reduce using plastics. Ah, and also reduce using plastics. Uh, yeah. That's very, very important. Yes. Well, you, should we check um, our yeah. people's answers for yeah, the bubble sure, map? Yeah, sure, sure. Can you show your answer now? Is everyone your ready answer? with your bubble map? Wow! wow look at that. Look at that. Okay, okay, I Maybe. can see a factor that caused the threat of extinction. Okay, Vimal, well done. I can see Falisha, also good. Tamilendi, yes. And Arisha, I can see all of them got the five mm. factors that we are talking about. Teacher, how about we get them to read out some of their answers? Sure, what can, can. Alright, we can okay. call up uh, maybe 
Uh, who would like to who would like to read out one factor? Who you can read out? Okay, Arisha. Okay. Yes, Arisha. Natural disasters. Mm. Natural disaster. Okay, good, Arisha. How about Falisha? You want to try one more? Yes. Pollution. 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 That's what we are talking about just now, right? Yep. Okay. And anyone else who want to add one more? Yes, Vimal? Yes, the illegal hunting. Illegal hunting. One more. Okay, Tamil Andy. Yeah. Global warming. Global warming. Yeah. Okay, good. So I have one more question to them. Oh, okay. What yeah. is the question? Teacher? So I want to ask them, okay, give me the products. Oh. The products that are made of uh, animal, animal skin. Animal skin. Yeah, animal but skin. especially uh, endangered species as okay, animals. Okay. okay. Who want to try? You want to give? Yes, uh, Farisha Amani? Yes, teacher. Products that are made from animals is ornaments. Ornaments, okay. Ornaments, that means uh, usually they use the tusk of the elephant. Oh, okay, so they will okay. decorate the house with the tusk, you know? You yes, have seen yes, that, yes, right? I've seen that, That's yeah. ornaments. Okay, now, anyone okay. else want to try other than that? Yes, Arisha, again. The example of animal product is coat. Coat. Good. We have a jacket here like and she's saying coat. Okay, yeah, coat okay. also Leather coat. jacket. Leather huh? coat. You know, they have a okay, coat. Very yeah. expensive, right? Yeah. So, but they're especially made of endangered species. We are not talking about the normal animals yeah. like uh, sometimes they take the bull, cow, or there's yeah. no problem. Okay. But uh, don't take from that endangered species. We have few here. Yeah, elephants. Uh, like yeah, elephant, elephant skin. skin. Okay. Yeah, elephant skin. All sometimes right. they take the uh, tiger skin, mm, you know. Uh, all that's right. uh, the clothes we're using. Okay, Vimal, you want to try one gift one? Yes, teacher Devi. Yeah. The products that are made from animal skin is handbag. Handbag. Very good. Handbag. Okay, we have handbag here. We have two handbags that's made of uh, animal skin. Mm. Okay, good. Who else? Anyone? One more? Who else have been tried? Okay, Tamil. Yeah, Tamil. Okay. Yes, teacher. Product that made made by from extinct animal is wallet. Uh, not extinct animal, yeah, and then just species, uh, and and then just species. Okay. okay, wallet. Well done, well done, uh, Tamil Indian. So these are the product we can find. Mm. Usually we can find uh, from outside wherever you go for shopping mall. You can find all these products. Right, right. Yeah. And, and teacher, how many marks should we should okay. you give our pupils for today? So far they did well, Chris. Yeah. So I think I want to give each of them three stars. Three stars. Yes. Good job, okay. everybody. Give Good yourselves job. a round well of applause. Done. Okay. Um, but first, is it okay if we take a short break, teacher? Sure, sure, can. Okay, there you go. Thank you very much, teacher, on sharing with us more on factors that affects threat of extinction. Okay. But we'll be right back after a short break. Don't go anywhere here at DDA TV KPM. KPM. Hi everyone, welcome to Slot Tahab Duo with me, Chris MJ, as well as Teacher Devi and my friends on Google Meets today. Where are they? We have Vimal, we have Falisha, we have Arisha, and we have Tamil. Hi, give me a wave. That's right, everyone is excited for today's lesson and today yeah. we are learning Science DLP for Year 6 on the topic of, what's the topic teacher? Uh, threat of Extinction. Threat of Extinction. Well, Miss Devi, what is uh, our next focus for this segment? Yeah. Since we have done about the factors, right? Okay. So we are going to learn about the importance, the importance oh. of preservation and conservation. Okay, before I go to the importance of preservation and conservation, I want to ask uh, some uh, one of our students here because they must know the meaning of preservation and conservation. Okay. It, they already learned in previous class. Yes. So, we, let us Let's ask them. Let's test their memory. Yeah, let okay. us test. Okay. So, who can tell me the meaning of preservation? Yeah, I can see Arisha raise her hand first. Yes, Arisha. Yes, teacher. Preservation means keeping animals and plants to their original balanced state. 
Ah, well done, Arisha. Good. Okay, so that's the one. Okay. And uh, let us ask what's the meaning of conservation. Okay, who want to tell me what's the meaning of conservation? Okay, Tamilendi. Yes, Tamilendi. What's the meaning of conservation? Yes, teacher. Conservation meaning uh, means returning animals and plants to their natural condition. Hmm. Returning them to the natural condition. Ah. So that's a conservation. Okay. So you should know that preservation is uh, conservation. That's yeah. a different thing. So both the answers are accurate. Accurate. Very okay. good, Tamilendi. Well done. Okay. Right. So now we go to the importance now. Okay. Importance of preservation conservation. First is preventing extinction. That's why mm. we must have preservation and conservation. Okay. Preservation and conservation help reduce the factors that threaten the animals and plants as well as increasing their population okay next is ensuring animals and uh, plants are not over exploited mm. let me reusing reducing recycling you know the three r uh, reusing re reduce reuse reuse reduce and recycle yeah exactly okay this is the three thing three r reduce the dependence on natural resources okay uh, and okay. Uh, these activities have to protect animals and plants from over exploitation okay so next we go to the another one uh, now one more point what are the importance of preservation conservation it are uh, maintaining a clean and healthy environment okay through this we can control logging such as selective logging and replanting activities help maintain the oxygen carbon dioxide a balance mm, okay that okay. means whenever you cut the trees make sure you plant, plant back a new, plant tree, back okay. new one so that how we plant everything okay and preventing loss of habitat designated sites such as forest reserves uh, marine parks and ramsar sites help prevent animals and plants from lo the losing their habitats ah, so so okay. they won't lose their habitat so this is the one i want to talk about the forest reserve forest reserve have you been to any forest reserve yes i've been to taman negara exactly very good that's one of the forest reserve ah. we have and nearby here we have a uh, uh, frim frim yes okay, okay. frim i haven't been to that one yeah so these are the forest reserve we have I now we actually got so many forest reserve in malaysia mm -hmm. okay so now we go to the quiz time. Oh, quiz time! Ah, okay. quiz time! Okay, let us ask any one of our pupils here. Okay, give two importance of preservation and conservation of animals and plants that are facing the threat of extinction. Oh, I Come saw on. Arisha raised the hand uh, the, the fastest. The fastest, so is it? Go, yeah. Okay, Arisha, give me one. Oh, no, Arisha, you haven't unmuted mic. your mic yet. You are mute. The mic. Yes, teacher. Yeah. The the importance of preservation and conservation is preventing extinction. Yes. Mm. Well done. It's preventing extinction. extinction. Yes. Okay. okay. We go to one more. Who wanna try? I gave. I asked for two. Okay, Vima. Yes, Vima. Yes, teacher. The importance of preservation and conservation is um. Preventing the loss of habitat. Loss of habitat. Yeah, very good. Well done, Mimal. Yes. Good job. So everybody. wow, they can give. I asked for two. Yep. Anyone want to add? Anyone want to add? We have four actually. Okay, Tamil. Yes, Tamil. Yes, teacher. The hmm. importance of preservation and conservation is maintaining a clean and healthy environment. Wow. Hmm. Well done. That's one more answer. Yeah. Healthy okay. environment. Yes. So how is our the, what? Do, what do you think is the overall performance for our friends on Google Meet today, teacher? Wow, oh, they're doing well. Wow, Good I'm really job. oh yeah. So I feel like I want to give everyone five stars. Reward five them stars. with the five stars. Yes, yes. congratulations everybody. Well. And okay, teacher, good. could you also share a summary of what we learned today? Yes, uh, Chris. Today. Uh, we just recap one. Okay, pupils are able to explain. Just now we can see, right? They can able to explain through examples the animals and plants that are facing the threat of extinction and uh, describe the factor that caused the threat of extinction to animals and plants. And people are able to generate ideas on the environment of preservation and conservation of animals and plants that are facing the threat of extinction. Ah, uh, there you go. Thank you very much, teacher. And one more question I have yes. is, how can our friends watching at home also get extra materials on today's uh. topic? 
Okay, actually they can go to the Sumberku KPM so they can find all the materials from there. All yeah. right. So with that, I would like to say thank you very much to Teacher Devi for today's very, very interesting class on threat of extinction. And with that, that's all from us today here at Tahap Dua. We will see you again only on Direct TV KPM. Bye, everybody. Bye.